Hey everyone, this is the Persona Nerd. This is Let's Play Sonic 3 and Knuckles, part 24. As you can see, Knuckles started out in a completely different version of the Incredible Night Zone with Pixel Loot Break and stuff, so. Yeah, this is totally different, but I mean, at the same time, it's the same level, so. Uh, there's also some uh, other pretty cool uh, things about this stage as well. Um, we'll see, uh. I'll show you what I'm talking about in a moment, so. very bottom of the stage, so, uh, that explains partly why this is different from, uh, Sonic's part. And, actually, in this zone, like, in the second half, it's actually possible to go through Sonic's portion of the stage as Knuckles, if you know how. Um, it's not very easy to get around as Knuckles on that portion, so you're probably just better off breaking the, uh, bricks that are there, so... And of course we got this super ring over here in this little door, it looks like. So, just get that, and be on our way. We'll also use that too, but it's quicker this way, I think. And here we have this guy again. Some things never change. Ah, yes. Uh, So yeah. Alright, then. Alright, so. I'm making. I'm gonna try to manipulate the camera so we can have him hit him. Run. Alright. Oh, got him! Look how many squares we have left this time. Did a lot better than we did in the last LP. Or last part of the album with Sonic, so yeah, it's pretty cool. All right, now this is very strange. For some reason, you actually start out in the same place you do as if you had played with Sonic. So uh, even though you were in a completely different place of the Carnival Night Zone in uh, Act One, so yeah, this should look pretty familiar right here. Just breeze through there. Some stuff to get there, but I mean, most people uh, like me just breeze through that stuff, so yeah. Um, now, another thing you might notice is there's actually no water in Knuckles, uh, part of the Carnival Night Zone, so that's one, like, really major difference that uh, sets this apart from Sonic's uh, version of the stage, so. He doesn't have to worry about drowning here, like, like Sonic, so... Pretty different. Um, and of course, this is an area only he can get to right off the bat, so already we see a major difference here. And this is actually towards the end of the stage here. That would be the part Sonic goes through before Knuckles launches him. And... Say, isn't this where we, uh, launched Sonic? Yeah. And of course, here's an interesting part of the stage. Knuckles actually has no boss here, so... You can pretty much just free the Flickies and just get on with it. Another interesting thing is the method of teleportation. <laughs> Teleport. So that was pretty quick. Um, we have an ice cap zone. This is where the avalanche goes, so Knuckles skips that whole snowboarding sequence that Sonic goes through, so yeah. Alright. But other than that, most for the most part the same stage. Uh Knuckles does have a part where he bran branches off to a separate part of the stage too. Like, as you can see, he broke that wall without even needing to, uh, take that little platform. I'm not gonna worry about getting the shield. Of course, you can't go up there because, like, certain parts of the stage are blocked, so this is a part of what you can get to. Normally, you have to glide through those ice things, but now that we're super knuckles, you don't even have to do that, so, yeah. Alright, onwards. As you can see, this is pretty fairly quick with Knuckles. A lot 
quicker than Sonic's path, so... <laughs> kind of running weird. Is why I don't like that bonus stage. Alright. So yeah, now we're actually gonna have to do strategy on this guy. Great. Um, that's the strategy we don't want to use. So yeah, he throws those things and they pretty much fall down. Uh, and of course he picks them back up again. Uh, hits on him. So yeah, pretty much just dodge him when he's doing that, and then, uh, I think this is the, uh, yeah, it's breaking him and stuff. Alright, that's it for him. Alright, that was got for Act 1, just barely. Now we are going to go to Act 2, and as you can see, we start off underground as opposed to overground, where Sonic starts off, so, yeah. Oh, crap, that was bad. Right, wings, my friends. a big ring over, over this way, um, I think, uh, let me just check that out real quick. Oh, shoot, I think I'm doomed. Or not? No, I was here all along, huh. Alright, I think there's a springboard somewhere here, too. Nope. That was bad. Uh, so yeah, there's a ring under the water there, so... In case you don't have seven Chaos Emblems by now, you can get that. I think Sonic may be able to get it too, I'm not sure. I never really choose to go through his other underground path and stuff, so... Oh great, it's gone. Here's the springboard I was thinking about. Okay. Right. Um, I can't remember whether it was those, uh... No. That's bad. Um, yeah. Let's learn how not to play Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Um, yeah, whatever. Uh... Right. Yeah, um, 
if you enjoyed seeing me screw up, rate, comment, subscribe. Um, thank you for watching. See you later.